guys. Everyone, please go wild and crazy. Keep the love going for Bronwyn Sweeney. Hello. 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 Hi. How are you doing? Are we well? Yeah. All right. Well, just to introduce myself to you guys, my name is Bronwyn, or as my autocorrect would say, brown sauce. <laughs> which is starting to feel a little rude and impersonal after all these years, if I'm honest. I thought these phones were supposed to be smart. But just to clear my accent up real quick, I can see most of you have gotten there already, but to clarify for the rest of the room, yes, I was born in Blackpool. <laughs> and yes, I hear how I sound too. But true story, my family moved to the US when I was a kid, right? I was born in Blackpool, then my family moved to the US when I was a kid. And instead of starting afresh and moving someplace cool, my family decided to move to the U.S. equivalent of Blackpool, which could only be Florida. <laughs> Florida, a place where a man once had sex with a dolphin, he claims seduced him. <laughs> Between you and me, though, I think the dolphin was asking for it. <laughs> but let's move on from Florida. I'll tell you a little bit more about myself. Comedy is not my full-time job. By day, I work in advertising. Are we all familiar? Well, thank you. Actually, your validation does mean a lot to me. But the way I have to explain my job to people is I'm the one making the videos on YouTube you don't want to watch <laughs> before the videos that you do, right? And I am fully aware that it is the longest five seconds of your life <laughs> when your hand is hovering over that skip button. It's some shit that took me months to make. Sometimes, even years. I was just crying out for five seconds of your time and respect. I know I'm like the online version of like a street chugger. Like you're just on your lunch break, eating a little prep baguette, trying to watch a video on how to get abs in 24 hours. And then I come along and I'm like, hey, how's it going? Hi there, hi, can I just get five seconds of your time? <laughs> I couldn't help but notice you're trying to watch a video on how to get abs in an impossible amount of time. <laughs> Can I interest you in this American Peloton ad that was lazily adapted for a British audience? <laughs> no one's flat looks like that here. <laughs> the crazy thing about working in advertising is I actually really like watching ads. I love watching ads. I can't get enough of them. And I realize now I've got a favorite category of advertising, which has to be food ads for horny women. <laughs> Do we know this kind of advertising? All right, it usually features things like ice cream, chocolate, things that are metaphors for sex, right? And the best example of this kind of advertising, without a doubt, is the Lint Lindor chocolate ball ads. <laughs> All right? So the ad opens with a super hot master chocolatier, who, sorry to break it to you, is not a master chocolatier in real life. No, no, no. He's a model who was formed from the juices of a woman's wet dream. <laughs> All right? But in the ad, we see our super hot master chocolatier as he seductively spoons melted chocolate in a bowl. Then he tantalizes us with his big whisk as he lifts molten caramel up at the screen, <laughs> dripping in front of our eyes. Then we cut to a woman who is at home alone, obviously. She bites into the ball of chocolate, out oozes the caramel, which is his jizz. <laughs> and then we cut to the tagline, which says, Lint Lindor Master Chocolatiers, making your wife come since 1845. <laughs> Wow, beautiful, delicious. I'll end on this, which is that, like I said, I've been working in advertising now for over 10 years, which is wild. But last summer, my hard work paid off and I got promoted to creative director. Thank you, that silence is, no, no, that's, that's great time. Honestly, I really don't need any encouragement, right? I appreciate it, but last week, I got paid real money to write the sentence, what is the word impossible? But the words, I'm possible. Coming soon to a tampon box near you. <laughs> you guys have been awesome. I've been Brown Sauce. Thank you and good night.